I'm Christine Ong Cochran. Real estate is what I do, but it doesn't stop at closing. Every day I meet amazing people. They have grit, they have guts, and they never give up. You don't need handouts from the government. You can do whatever you put your mind to. I am American Made. And these are the stories of American-made successes. What's the true foundation of a home? Well, on the exterior, we see the bricks and mortar. In real estate, we talk comps and price per square foot. It's the foundation of those who live on the inside of these walls and who they are and what they do that makes a house a home. The sacrifice, the values, experiences, memories, and visions all begin right here. Strong foundations at home construct strong communities. It's my goal to show you the heart of the home and the heart of the American dreamer who lives right here. Welcome to American Made, where American dreams are made into American successes with me, Christine Ong Cothran. I'm a real estate agent and investor, small business owner, and proud American. I'm also one of those few Arizona natives. Actually, my ancestors have been here in Arizona before Arizona became Great State 48. In fact, this right here is the suitcase my grandmother came over with, and it's the memory of her journey to the land of opportunity that is the reason I love chasing the American ideals of life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness, and doing so with amazing people. And so this is where real American success stories come together in real estate. As a third generation Arizonan, it's my mission to make the Grand Canyon State and America grand, one home at a time. So Mike, you started off as a client, became a friend, and now you're more than anything like a brother to me. So let's talk about, so it's currently a four bedroom home, five and a half bathrooms, 8,500 square feet, but what's your vision with Ludmore? Well, you know me, as we started looking at homes together, you know that I can't resist a fixer upper. Um, you know, fortunately this home doesn't really need a whole lot of work, but. Um, you know, I'll do some paint and flooring. I'm going to redo uh, the master bath. And uh, interestingly, there's the opportunity to turn it into a six bedroom, eight bath home. So uh, I'm done, you know, started some work on that now and we'll continue to do that. But uh, yeah, I kind of uh, figure the more the merrier. You know, we've already proven that, you know, we can have 10 or 12 people in here and it doesn't feel full. So I figured, you know, let's add a couple more bedrooms and you know, we'll really have some fun here. So people are, let's be honest, feeling a little bit uneasy uh, out there. We're coming out of COVID. There have been a lot of businesses that have not made it and have permanently shut their doors. I think you and I have talked about a few of those from where you've come from. So what would you tell those watching out there? What would be a piece of advice, Mike, some steps that they could take to get to where you are today? You're, you answer to you. There's no excuses. There's no, I'm too tired. There's no, I'll do better tomorrow. It's, you make it happen every day or you're not gonna have your own business. So first of all, demand a lot of yourself because that's gonna be one of the biggest things. Um, find a vehicle, find something that you love because, you know, just like, you love doing real estate and you wake up every day excited and motivated and you get out of bed and you're like, man, I can't wait for today. I'm going to close on a new house. I got another client coming in. All these things inspire you and motivate you to do, you know, do your very best work. So find a vehicle that you love, whatever that is. And, and that's going to inspire you to get up and, and be motivated every day to, to accomplish your goals. And, um, I'd say the one other thing is, write things down. A goal not written is only a dream. You know, as soon as you write it down and commit it to paper, it becomes real. And 
you know, we used to teach people to write their short-term goals, like what do they want to do this week, what do they want to do this month. Their mid-term goals, like what do you want to accomplish in the next six months or the next year. And their long-term goals, like what do you want to accomplish, you know, five years down the road. And we used to do this exercise every week where we would rewrite our goals. And it wouldn't always just be financial goals or it wouldn't always just be a, you know, a goal related to business. It might be, you know, my wife really wants to go to Hawaii. So, you know, maybe one of my goals is in October, I'm gonna take her to Hawaii. And that's, that's gonna be a big motivation for me to hit my business goal. So I have an opportunity to do some of my personal things that I wanna do. So um, I think that would be the advice that I would, I would give a young person today that's just starting off. Love it. Well, I love you, brother. I love you Thanks too, sis. Thanks for joining me. You got it. Thank <laughs> you. Really appreciate you having me on. It's key to partner with the best. Now I'd like to introduce you to two of my partners, Ms. Sharon Lechter. She's authored exactly 26 books and counting. <laughs> uh, advocates financial literacy in all she does. And a true icon, actually two true icons of playing big. Welcome Thank to you. American Made. Thanks for being here. So a lot of what American Made is, is it's highlighting American success stories. And it's not always easy, right? Um, but to, to be big, you have to play big, think big, grow rich. You say that one plus one ought to equal 11. I feel like it's 110 <laughs> being around the two of you. <laughs> um, and you also talk about how every phone call can change your life. And I'll never forget the day, actually it happened over the course of many days and many months, shame to say, um, that Sharon, you called me and you reached out about an extraordinary opportunity that you and Michael, you uh, got involved with. So tell me, about that and tell our viewers what that opportunity is. EXP. It's a, a, a business model that sells itself. Sources, of, multiple sources of income. Um, okay, so you run the numbers, you want to play. Well, as you well know, I teach people about fin financial principles and how to build assets in their life, buy, build, or create assets. And so when my friend Lisa Copeland was in, told me she was involved in this new company, I said, tell me more. And she started sharing it with Mike and I. And it's a very state-of-the-art, mm -hmm. cutting-edge, um, totally virtual real estate company that's kind of taken the world by storm. Yeah, the, the pundits say that EXP is to real estate what Amazon was to fulfillment. And it really is. It's taking, giving, you know, the, the, the founder, um, Glenn Sanford, he's dedicated to making millionaires out of real estate agents. Too many real estate agents out there go from commission to commission without ever building true wealth. So they're chasing the dollars. And that's not how you build assets. And so EXP has built into their model the ability for real estate agents to do that transa transactional income getting commissions from buying and selling properties, but also along the way, building their equity value, getting stock in the company, becoming owners. So from your first transaction, you're an owner in the company. And that's what I think is so beautiful because it allows people to build that passive income stream. And so you, you talk about power of association. You and I met many years ago mm -hmm. through um, a whole different um, set of business arrangements. You were selling me mm -hmm. advertising. And then we met again through political circles, but it was like, here we go. I see she's out there selling real estate. This is something that could really benefit you as well as your future, and so. And there's also revenue sharing. Part of what would otherwise go to the broker goes to the individual agent. And you're, you're able to generate, uh, just you, talk to me, mama. <laughs> well, it marks off all the quadrants, on. right? Yes. Of yep. the cash flow quadrant. <clears throat> so, That's I mean, right. you've taught financial literacy since, what is it, the early 90s. Mm -hmm. And this mm -hmm. is just, you know, if I may, it's just another way for you to propagate that message. It's a way for real estate mm -hmm. agents to move from the left side of the quadrant, which is where you're exchanging time for money, right? Chasing money and, you know, spending time getting paid 
to move to the right side as well, where you're, where you're having the equity ownership, and so your money's working for you, and you have the ability to, you know, you, 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 you can only make so much money given seven days a week, 24 hours in a day. And we get onto that rat wheel, right? You're chasing money. If you can take that and invest your time in buying, building, creating assets by an EXP, as an example, building that equity, you build the right side of the quadrant income, which is infinite. You can make as much money there as possible. And EXP also gives you the opportunity to find investment properties to invest in, so have real mm -hmm. estate that works for you. We have a tenant paying for your monthly expenses and you're getting the income. Because the wealthiest people in the world either made their money through real estate or they hold their wealth in real estate. And so this is a great opportunity to get into the business from the inside so you can see those deals, particularly now when supply is kind of tight. When you're on the inside of EXP, you have the opportunity to see properties and sometimes even before they get listed on the MLS. EXP really is like its own little world. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and it's a global company mm -hmm. and uh, you know, and I, I remember talking to you, Sharon, long ago and you said, Christine, I've never aligned myself with a single company until now. It's true. Yeah, because I've always been dedicated to education. I've never gone inside a company where um, I, you know, I, I tell people about it to get a profit from it. But I feel so strongly about what this company offers. And Mike is the one that got his real estate license. And so we're very open about it. We're very, but we want to open it. We just, on my way here to this interview, I was on the phone with the president of global operations for EXP talking about um, people that I have in Italy and potentially in Brazil through, through you as, as a matter of fact. So we have an opportunity to make this available to people all over the world. And compared to other real estate agents, a, EXP does not limit you to where you live. So you have friends that are in Illinois, they can join EXP as part of your organization. Somebody in New York City, somebody in Italy. So it gives you the opportunity, it truly is a global company. Definitely, love it. So, you know, it's hope, it's action, it's the six inches between here and there that, um, that propel us to, you know, find where we're deficient. We find others mm -hmm. to, to pour into us, building that team. It's just such an honor to be part of a team with you, Sharon, and you, Michael. Well, right back at you. We're very excited to have you or Spitfire <laughs> and keeping us going, keeping us on our toes. And that's what it's all about. All of us working together, creating that, that engine for us to continue supporting each other. Because you know, one of us has a fantastic day, everybody rises to the occasion to celebrate. And that's what teamwork, and that's what this is all about, is, is celebrating others and creating success that they so richly deserve. So if you're an agent, you can become an entrepreneurial real estate agent today with Michael, Sharon, and I by joining EXP. Here's your invitation. You can go to my website. If you're an agent, we invite you to come along with us. ChristineCothran.ExpRealty.Careers. And when you join EXP, you become part of a global family of agents and partners dedicated to transforming the real estate experience and your family's generational wealth. Thank you for joining us for American Made, where American dreams are made into successes. 